my name's Hedy. I'm the big cheese founder of travel gift card, mytab.co. It is a .co, it is not a .com, and this is Muppet Bundle Cundle, who's got the most enormous paws in the world. Today we're talking about how to make a resume online with Google Docs. If you've got a resume and Word document, just copy and paste it over. You'll need to format it a bit, so I'll show you how to do that, and you can use that as a template for your own layout. How simple. Okay, so we're basically looking at this one now. We're going to change this over to the untitled document. Uh, head is resume slash CV, curriculum vitae, it's Latin. And then go over to a Word document. So basically, I've got an old version down here. Now, I've not looked at my resume, God, it's like got about two years. Copy and paste, control C, control V, or Apple C, Apple V. Copy that over and then paste it. It's not going to come out the exact same layout, but then press control V and it's now pasted over. So now you've got that in Google Docs. Now remember that they save every three seconds on here. So don't panic if you've lost the information. And you're going to end up putting in your address and your, your contact information. And I'm not going to do all of mine because I can't be bothered doing it now. And you obviously don't need to know what mine is. Because if you spam me or you stalk me, I will go nuts. Remember, I do Israeli martial arts and I know things about things. So you're looking down here now and you're looking at the layout. But some of these didn't really 100% format very well, like this one down here. So what you can do is you can change the font size to it, okay? That's, that's way too small, but you can start playing around with it. And that's the only reason I'm doing just now. Play around with this, move things around, drag and drop. Maybe you want to change it so it's not one and a half space size, um, but you want to make things smaller. That's now got hyperlinks to it. I don't want hyperlinks in there. That's really irritating. So you might have to remove all of these, which just drives me nuts because it shouldn't be down there, but it automatically includes hyperlinks like Marriott Hotels, etc. God, I work there so many years ago when I was such a young spring chicken and then reset and bring back some of the tabs over here so everything's aligned a bit but I mean at least you've got the main gist of what we're doing down here now and then you're good to go and you'll see that it always auto saves so all you can do is either basically create a new document over in Google Docs and you can upload that or what you can do is what I did grab an old resume from God knows how long ago copy and paste it over it's already in there and you just need to reformat it it'll be one and a half space size because it usually does that but just go into your editing tools right at the very top it will and adjust and it will edit that and you're good to go and then you can make it single spacing how easy is that then you can share you can email it out you can say to companies hey you're interested in my resume here's the link to it and you can share it out that way as opposed to an email but you can't pdf it up so i prefer always that you always go do it as a word document pdf it up so nobody can edit it and that's say like unpdf my name's hedy i'm the big cheese founder of travel gift card mytab.co it is a .co it is not a .com and this is how muppet jives and dances on a sunday